Welcome back to AlgebraJS. Today's question is leak code 378, cave smallest element in a sorted matrix. So given an n by n matrix, where each of the rows and columns is sorted in ascending order, return the cave smallest element in the matrix. Note that it is the cave smallest element in the sorted order, not the cave distinct element. You must find a solution with a memory complexity better than O n squared. So in example one, we have an output of 13. And the reason for this is that 13 within this array, so the matrix flattened, 13 is at index k minus 1. So whenever a question says k smallest element or k largest element, the first thing you should think of are heaps. So here we can use a max heap in order to work out the k smallest element. So firstly, let's create a heap. So we create the heap from the numbers we've been provided, filling in, filling in from left to right. So this is our current heap. Now we need to convert this into a max heap. Now that we've sorted the heap into a max heap, let's look at the size of this heap. So the size of this is equal to nine. Now, as long as this size right here of this max heap is greater than K, we haven't found K smallest element. But as soon as size is equal to that, the top element within this max heap will be the K smallest element. So all we need to do is remove the top element X amount of times until size is equal to K, and then we can return the top value within the max heap. So let's run through this. We have 15 here, we need to remove this. And in order to do that with a heap, we flip it with the last value. So we flip it with 10. 15 is switched with 10, and then we can remove this 15. So 15 has been removed, size is decremented to eight. Now we need to convert this into a max heap. So 10 is gonna switch with 13, 10 is gonna switch with 13 again. Now all we need to do is peek at the top element. Or if we're using max priority queue provided by leak code, we just need to look at front dot element. So for this, JavaScript doesn't have the inbuilt heap ABI. So we're going to assign a priority queue to the max heap. Then we need to loop through the matrix. So for each element within the matrix, we can look at the row and then we need to loop through the row. We can grab the element and then for each element, we need to add that to the heap. So every element we see within the row, we add it to the max heap and then we do a check within this. So as long as the max heap size is greater than K, we can dequeue from this, so we can remove from the max heap. And we'll keep on doing this until the size of the max heap is equal to K. Once that is the case, we can look at the top element. So it'll be max heap dot front dot element. And that will be the K smallest element within the sorted matrix. Let's give that a run. Submit it. And there you go. 